all things Pelicans, you tuned in to the Pelican Post Game Report. Much love to the flock. Appreciate you guys for joining me for this episode of Pelican Post Game Report. PPR Weekly, we up in this thing. I'm Big Q. Please feel free to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and the share button. Light up all the notifications for future content from the PPR stream. We up in this thing, man. Appreciate the fam. As we're just kind of giving you a uh, kind of a recap to a degree of what happened uh, this past Thursday in the preceding news after the fact that the Pelicans were able to make some moves and do a few things. So we're going to kind of open the, the broadcast up with some of the things the Pelicans were able to do in terms of adding undrafted talent. And this should make DJ pretty happy to hear what the Pelicans are doing is the Pelicans are to, you know, the Pelicans to sign Landers, Noli, and Tevin Jones and Liam Robbins. Now we had the reports. I got the indications that the Pelicans assigned a trio of undrafted players as we get ready for a uh, summer league as well as that's coming and popping in in early July. So that's good news as well. So let's cover some of this information. The Pelicans assigned a trio of undrafted players, according to reports from Jake Wingarten of StockRisers.com, John Chepkek, Jepkovich of DraftExpress.com and Michael Scotto of Hypes of Hoops Hype. And the three players are Cincinnati guard Landers, Landers Noli, the second Southern Utah wing Tavion Jones and Vanderbilt big man Liam Robinson. So the terms of the contract, of course, wasn't disclosed. It's unclear if they might be on two way deals or exhibit no uh, a 10 day training contracts. All that will be kind of ferreted out in time in line for the bonus worth of the 75 grand if they're waived and they spent up to 60 days with the Pelicans G League affiliate team which they really need to improve we talked about that all three prospects are ESPN's best undrafted players list Robbins is ranked number six Noli is number 23rd and Jones is listed as number 39 in terms of Robbins who played for Drake in Minnesota prior to finishing out his career at Vanderbilt who's the SEC defensive player of the year in 22 and 23 Average 15 points a game, seven rebounds, and three blocks per contest. He was shot, oh, he shot a five, uh, 50% shooting. You know, that's not bad at all. 300, and then, of course, 36.5% shooting from beyond the field and the three point line, 73% shooting from the foul line. So he managed to put up numbers in just 23 minutes per contest over 26 games, including 15 starts. Noli played for the uh, Virginia Tech and Memphis before going to Cincinnati for his senior year, averaging almost 17 points a game, six boards, almost three assists per contest and a steal per game. Not bad. He's shooting 44 percent uh, from the field, 41 percent from downtown and 75 percent from the shooting from the foul line. So in 36 games, he averaged over 32 points a game for Cincinnati. And of course, Jones started his college career at Illinois before transferring to Southern Utah as a what they call super senior. Uh, last year, he averaged almost 18 points a game, four and a half rebounds and 1.1 on the steals. Uh, he shot just under 41 percent, 36 percent from downtown and was 84 percent from the foul line in 36 games. He averaged 34 minutes per contest for the Thunderbirds. And there you go. So he impressed during the uh, Partsmouth Invitational Tournament, which is used as a springboard for lesser known prospects. So the Pelicans were able to get a few of these guys lined up, man, and added to the team. So Liam Robinson, seven feet tall, 235 pound. They call him a forward type over there so it's going to be interesting to see how the pelicans use these guys we'll keep an eye out on some of these guys headed into summer league and ultimately into the g league if some of them can get beyond that but liam robinson who's a big on me at 129 games that you can kind of see some of his numbers there the other player there is tavion jones 6'7, 190 from chandler arizona 126 career games right there for him and these guys look like they're interesting prospects for the Pelicans. Landers Noli the second there, showing 125 games that he's played in during his career. So these guys have a lot of experience in college playing. And it's going to be fun watching them and see exactly where they are fit in terms of the team going forward. OK, so that's some of the latest moves as far as the undrafted situation is concerned, dealing with the Pelicans.